Hi guys, it's Asa Koptis. Okay guys, it's really late here, but I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna. I have to record this video before I go to bed because it take me a little bit some time to, you know, edit and save more lately. Save anyway. Um. So I'm okay. Sorry about this. Uh, project. I don't have to do for you guys. Um. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. Did. I out a cog. See there. Um, this is Clark uh, Lausanne. Uh, her YouTube name Lausanne. Um, I'm sorry. I will have to put her link down below. I saw a lot of people out um alarm clock, so I want to, you know, buy one. And Lausanne, she uh, said, you know, she bought her a Target, and I went on my Target. I didn't see it, and she's so sweet she offered to send me one so I yay thank you Lasana and it um you know it's like uh plastic but it's it make it look like uh metal but it's not okay at first I altered this like a long long time ago and then I stopped because I didn't like the color you know but I I cannot even tell you guys how I get this look because I make it so messy <laughs> because I you know I cover all with the paper some of the paper and then I spray the color red and I didn't like it I just stopped like a month or a couple of months something like that at first I thought like oh my god I'm not gonna finish this I gonna throw it away I said oh, I can't throw it away because Rosanna gave it to me so she you know post bought the stuff and you know, send the poses to me like, okay, I have to keep doing this. So here we go. It came out. Okay, as I said, guy, I did, you know, uh, modeling paste. Okay, so here we go on the side here. Okay, you can see the detail. I love it. But you know what? A, a lot of things going on here. <laughs> And I said, guys, I just not see you guys can see there's some paper there. You not even can tell huh, what kind of paper. Yep. And I use my small honeycomb stencil there, a modeling paste. And I use the uh, crackle. Oh, that guy. See that? So I just do the whole thing. Then this on the back. You know, on the back, like, it's, it's real cut on the back, it's what, um, it's like, really, it's not flat, it then in, you know what I mean, guys? I just trade off that, uh, cut into shipboard, and I, I use a uh, paper line, Prima, I'm not sure what kind of Prima, um, hang on a second, guys. Oh, I use this one, uh, Physic Glen. Okay, now I found it. So I use this uh, Pima paper, that 8x11 Physic Glen. So both in, um, outside, and I didn't use the, um, hang on, okay. I didn't use the glue anything because I just made the cut it to really tight, and then I put it there, and then I use the modeling paste around the edges here. That's it. And what else? Um, okay, I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, so a little reflection. So this, first of all, this this angel there is from my store that I'm selling. This guy, see, it actually like this white color, and I just saw it first, guys. After I just saw, let it dry, and then I use my um this. For acrylic paint, I just paint the hair. So and for the body, so you want to get like antique look. I um I believe I use this color, the coffee latte. And you want to uh, wash the color again with the when it's white or it's just I always do that. Even though I use this, I always wash the color. It make look like um only on antique look. So that one that I used, I have two sizes though guys, it's so cute huh? So I have this uh, 2 inches wide wing and this 3 inches 
So I use this big one because it's kind of big clock, guys. Okay. And for the here is the upper bit here, the chipboard, the the big cap here said mother loves here, and the S is way back there, guys. <laughs> I'm not sure you guys can see. You know, I was, uh, you know, pour in and out a lot of stuff. So I didn't, sorry guys, I didn't have the tutorial for you guys for this. Anyway, this uh the wood uh, window here for my store. You guys can check it out. And I use a lot of my stuff, of course, guys, because um, I'm going to have to do a lot of hard work you know, to promote my store because I don't think anybody can meet my demand. For my designer team, I don't think it's that hard because think about it, one month only four project, guys, you know. Anyway, it's good so I don't have to spend money but, you know. And I use, oh, my wood bicycle too. Isn't that cute? At first, I thought I might want to use it. It's just a little bit too high so I to do this one so again I paint in uh, my Ventus white and use some blue and with some uh, coffee latte here so to get some mixed color and this is what you guys call moss or something I'm not sure but what is here this I got at a dollar tree guys so only a dollar so I use that one in the front so of course I use my uh, shipboard fence. Okay, show you guys. Only tiny fence, huh? So I paint this in my winter's white with the same color, blue and coffee latte to get some of that look. And what? Else? Oh, I I use my a little tiny bird. Damn, you guys can see that it's so cute. I just love it. The first let me see it's so so tiny so this is the one that I use it's so tiny huh? it's so cute I think I believe I have three sizes but I have only um, the medium size and the tiny size a lot so that one is the medium size I'm not sure I still have the big size and I use Amy hi Amy Amy flowers there guys you see that I'm not sure I can Stop using Amy flowers, and I just love, love that that flowers. I I don't know. It's just perfect size for me. Okay, this it it. I make it. I'm not sure you guys can tell. It make look. Uh, I plan to make look like a rock. I hope it look like it. It's actually a really tiny marble that I have like in the whole container like this. I usually I throw it out and I just kept this a little bit I might use something and now that it and now if I want to make like a rock can I have to go buy a new one I didn't do it away guys so I did paint it in a uh, wire acrylic paint painted it a couple of times and then I um, used cracker but it did not show cracker guys but it's okay look like a rock to me I like it and what else um, and the picture of me and Cody in there and a little bit inside the sentiment I'm sure you guys let's see but, oh, so this pseudo rock in there is good because it makes this one still still before I didn't put rock, rock marble in there you know it start to fall backward guys so this one is uh, what it called uh, keep the clock still still though okay I'm gonna turn this one on the side there is uh, Tim Ho on it I'm not sure if you can see the Tim Ho on it there and my wood is um, sentiment there know in your heart you are love not sure you can read and under the wood I use a little bit trim underneath I'm not sure you guys can see it or not and I use the Tim Ho bread to attach to other on it there on the the Tim Ho, the on it there. I'm not sure if I pronounce it right either. <laughs> so I did paint with wire acrylic paint. That's it, guy. See. And what's uh, on this? Okay. Let me see. I can see 
the wood clock there from my store. I just, you know, the one, the last project I, um, outside the layout, I didn't use, so I just paint with the wire click on the top. That's it. I didn't paint on the side anything. And I use it, uh, my glitter, my glitter that's, and this is flower space, actually white. And I paint it in, um, my blue and then dab some uh, wire acrylic paint on this and this and me flower I insert in there and this my flower from my store I insert in there and that's the pink flower the same with this one is Emmy flower too guy and my flower spray the crystal there and this uh, sheep wood butterfly that I paint in wire acrylic paint and then I use the glitter on it so it actually look like this I paint in white acrylic paint and put a little bit of glue and you know sparkle with the glitter on it. It's just so pretty. I love it. And this my tiny flowers. I'm not sure you can see a little bit of this. All this I paint hand paint this guy. I'm not sure you can see. And literally that um, that uh, charm bulb there. I'm not sure you can see. This is so cute. I just love this guy. See that that one? I used inside that one. I used the uh, micro bead inside the box. Um, that one is the clear micro beads from Stamming Up. I got it long, long time ago, guys. And uh, ticket sentiment there. Thank you for being my sunshine every day. That my sentiment in that one is actually true, guys. Uh, my life is I don't know. It's more happy when. Saying I have Cody in my life, so that's really good sentiment there. Um, I think pretty much that it, guys. So that one on the top, right there. I think pretty much that. It. I don't think I missed anything. Um, I think I did fussy cut my photo of me and Cody in there. So when you. Cody like when he was a uh, little like that, he liked to sleep like that guy, you have to carry him around like that. <laughs> um, that's it guy, thank you guys for keep watching, I have to, you know, go to that guy, you have to get up 5 o'clock in the morning to work again. Alright guys, um, I will put the link down below so you guys can check out a photo of uh, this project on my blog. Thank you guys for keep watching. I will see you guys later. Bye guys. Good night.